guys, Steph here from thegoodride.com and in this video we are checking out the Satu pants from Outdoor Vitals. These are the doodle pants. It's the, they're like adventure pants but also fancy enough to wear around town. These are the size 6 so I'll put my specs below just so you can kind of see how it compares there. Uh, but they're pretty simple pants. I'll show you that. They come up kind of mid-waist, I'd say they're mid-high. They have a slimmer fit. Uh, they come with two side pockets here that have like a mesh uh, lining. So it keeps it lightweight and breathable. And then it has one side cargo pocket here that you can put whatever you want in. It also has the same mesh lining. Uh, you put whatever you want there and then it has two pockets in the back. Right there, but there's no closure or zippers there, just the two pockets, but it does have this over the top flap. So these are super lightweight. Uh, I believe the 30 by 30 men's size is 13 ounces. So these are these are even lighter than that. Uh, they are water resistant, odor and bacteria resistant. Um, they're quick drying, and they also have. Uh, they come with a shoelace gaiter hook, and and you can also cinch this up to kind of adjust the pant length. So if you wanted to pull them up and adjust the length of the pants, then you can do that as well for, you know, biking or whatever it is that you need to do. So yeah, these pants, I wore them for a few days, you know, I tried them out in a bunch of different situations um, around town, walking the dog, going on a hike, just, they're pretty comfortable. I mean, they have a lot of movement to them, but they stay pretty nice and uh, they still look good. And they do, I tested them with water and they resist water is just like a I was pouring water on it for about five seconds and it didn't really even saturate the fabric when I rubbed the water in to try to get it to go into the fabric it dried really quickly like within a matter of like seconds uh, maybe to one minute tops so here I wanted to see how long it would actually take for running water to saturate the pants and I couldn't really get it to soak all the way through without squeezing the water through so it stayed really quite water resistant uh, the whole time that I was running water on them. They're still not wet on the inside. Nice. Here's the inside after running all that water and yeah, it's still not wet. That's pretty cool. Squeeze it through, and now it comes through finally. It's got pretty good water resistance. It's just getting splashed, or like if you were to get rained on, I think it would hold up pretty well. Now we're going to see how long it takes these to dry. Make sure they're all fully saturated, but I'll wring them out. let it dry on the porch. Okay, 9.50. And they are wet. So it's been an hour. Well, it's been like 50 minutes. And it's a little wet on the bottom of the cuffs. Tiny bit damp on the, um, on the pocket but it is basically super dry. So it's really cool. And these were like soaking wet, like saturated, dripping. Um, it's a little wet here on the seams and stuff, just where there's a little bit more layers and where it was kind of laying on the fence. But everything else that was in the air is like, is super dry. They also have two vents on the side here. So they keep it nice and breathable here and here which is nice uh, for hiking or whatever so yeah and they have like a pretty soft feel to them it's not uh, they're really quiet when you move they move with you they're pretty comfortable uh, they have a nice stretch uh, at the top here there is an adjustable waist uh, cord that you can just if it's just a little loose you can just tighten it up there they do have belt loops 
And they also have an option for the same kind of pants but in shorts. So if you're looking for a water resistant, stain resistant, odor, bacteria resistant, um, flexible, stretchable fabric that's non-spandex and quick drying and lightweight, then maybe the Satu pants or shorts from Outdoor Vitals could be a good option.